An award-winning filmmaker died Wednesday morning after he was attacked by a shark while swimming at a popular beach in New Zealand. Stuff News heard from a fisherman who witnessed the attack. We saw the shark, we saw the shark thin and thin of the shark, and next minute, boom, attack him. And then bloody everywhere on the water. The shark may have been up to 14 feet long. The head lifeguard told the New Zealand Herald once his team discovered that the shark was still near the body, it took them some time to come up with a plan. It's been the early 70s since there was last a um, recorded shark attack on a human in mainland New Zealand, so um, there's nothing in our books on how to deal with it, I've got to say. The BBC reports police took inflatable rubber boats into the water and fired at the shark. He has discharged his firearm towards the shark. We do not know at this stage whether or not he has hit the shark, but the shark rolled off and uh, disappeared. Police fired as many as 20 shots. The International Business Times reports the victim was 46-year-old Adam Strange, a television and short film director. He was a well-known filmmaker who had been a finalist at the Cannes International Advertising Awards. In his spare time, Strange said he liked to surf on the West Coast. He also enjoyed skiing, mountain biking, and live music. The Daily Mail reports Strange's family described him as a glorious and great father, husband, and friend. For Newsy, I'm Katie Brennan. Multiple sources, a broader view.